Hi. Hello. So today, um, Melody and I are doing a girls day because our is fixing the bathroom. So we decided to come out to Doylestown to the Shrine of Chestahova is doing their annual um, Polish festival, Polish American festival. I have a feeling we're going to listen to a lot of music and watch a lot of singing and dancing. I don't think we're going to be able to tell anything they're saying because I'm pretty sure from what I remember, everything's in Polish. Last time I checked, I don't speak it, but that's okay. We'll still have fun. Right, Mel? Yeah. So, Shrine to Chestahova. It will be fun. Yeah. Something to do. Can't wait to see. Here's the shrine. They're doing a ton of construction. A ton. Okay, so we just got in the entrance for the Polish American Festival. Let's see the paper, Mel. So they give you a paper of like outlining everything that's going on. Um, so we're just gonna check out a bunch of things. Melody's hungry. They, it looks a lot bigger than um, what I'm used to. Can you put down? Um, so there's a ton of vendors here. Um, obviously, like they're selling like a lot of Polish goods. Um, it's to support the China Chestahova in Doylestown. Um, there's food, there's midway rides, and that's included with your admission. So you pay $12 per person to get in, and that is including all the rides. Um, so it's a pretty good deal. Um, so we're gonna hang out and we'll show you um, throughout the day what's going on. So, couple things about this video. I did it without Albert. Yay me. A lot of this video is gonna be messed up and like you're gonna have lines like this on both sides because I completely forgot that you have to tilt the camera like this <laughs> when you're filming yourself. Your phone's supposed to be tilted a certain way. <laughs> I didn't do that. All right, you got the potato and cheese. How are they? Good. Homemade? Yeah. They're very full. What did you get, mine? I didn't get anything. These are all yours. I didn't know. You wanted two orders. They're four for four dollars, so a dollar a piece. And you can ask for onions. Try the pierogi. Like you can tell. Those are fresh made pierogies, potato and cheese. All right, very full. All right, get some onion on them. That's really good. That is so fresh. That is so fresh. What do you think? It's really good. Really good. Alright, so we just finished our pierogies and it looks like more vendors. It says the Polish Village. So this is going to be all Polish goods. It's very loud. So Melody wanted to listen to the Polish music and it's right next, one of the stages is right next to the Polish Village. So I'm going to show you around the Polish Village really quick. Um, I don't remember this, but I have to be honest, I haven't been here in probably 10 years or so, so they've really expanded. cooking on it. They have face painting. And again, this is all of your admission. 
donation includes all of this, um, but you can do donations for the local Polish school. They have a little petting zoo back there as well. Apparently there's one named Petunia. Maybe Petunia is in the back. There's a bowl, a mechanical bowl we'll go check out. And a whole bunch of baked goods. Everything's written in Polish. Okay, it tells you everything. Oh, maybe not everything. <laughs> I don't know. This makes sense to me. Woulda. Basically, how they say it in Philly, anyways. Here's the mechanical wall. I'm not gonna ride that. I'll get a migraine because everything gives me a migraine. Okay, so they would wear those with their uniform. They'd hold them with their uniform? Okay. It's kind of left, left over from the morning stars from the Middle Ages. Mm -hmm. oh, we, it's heavy enough to use as a weapon. Or yeah, definitely. Now, would this be a higher rank? Yes. Because it's, yeah. It's definitely a certain rank. I'd be like a lieutenant. This is the king. Oh, that's the king. Okay. We need to refurbish it, but uh, so it's very similar to Soviet's. 
This is so amazing. I love it. Sometimes you think, oh, that's just a fantasy. No, that is a reproduction of the actual. Wow. And the wings are really That perfect. is. So they're lighter. Wow. So actual and reproductions. You see that have a face guard. Mm -hmm. But for parade, they would turn it around. Okay. And you just have you know, feathers or, or just have it like this one has the uh, armor. It's is, uh, scale, which is very intricate. Yes. Holy moly, that's heavy. Mm -hmm. And it was actually worn by CBS this type of armor. Look at how fascinating this is. Now, did you hear what she said? So a lot of these had face guards up here. Um, and sometimes they'd use these up as face guards, but then for parades and things like that, they would actually turn them around so they could see. I think Daddy should have come to, Shai should have come to. But this is really um, very heavy and well-made armor. And she said it's actual reproductions. Um, of how it used to be made, and it's very heavy. All right, I found the beer garden. They have a whole beer garden here, right next to the Midway um, games. Jewelry that is absolutely gorgeous. And we're gonna go back to the shop. Spaka tasting. It's a separate emission. Spaka tasting. You Did you some? know they made Polish vodka? I love vodka. Tequila and vodka. Be right back. More vendors. Lots of vendors. So Melody and I have a Color Street thing coming up, so we're going to go see how the Color Street lady set up. Oh, yeah, I know. If we can find her, Polish pottery, so pretty. Dude, there's Polish ice. Funnel cakes. Funnel cakes. But I don't know if that constitutes as lunch. Because there's Polish ice. <gasps> Coffee. Is Am I in the frame? Yeah. Alright. So good. I haven't had these in years. The meat mixture is perfect. It's like not overly seasoned. Alright. Melody's going to try some stuffed cabbage. What do you think? Not bad. I know, it's good, right? Grab them from a hoagie. They're huge. It's um, one for four and two for seven, but they're huge. I can only eat half of it. Lemonade, birch beer. Melody, what'd you get? Birch beer, that's, that's really good. Out of a tap. Old fashioned birch beer. 16 ounces out of the tap. I got a fresh squeezed lemonade. very good. She's smelling my lemonade. I don't know why. It's quite sour. She does not like my lemonade. I'm it's sour. I like sour lemonade. Lemon. I like Alex's lemonade better. Okay. Here, so we're gonna go over here. It looks like some kids stuff going on. 
So if you come on the back side of the tent, you can see that is all chicken in there, smoking. They just turned it. Oh, wow. I'm going to have to take some of that barbecue chicken home for my husband because he is a good man. He let the girls come have fun while he's working on the bathroom. All right, now we're in the midway section. So corn, rides, tattoos, games, bounce houses, more rides. Now this is all included in your admission for $12. So it's an awesome place to bring the kids something to do. Um, a beautiful day out today. Fun slide. Melody and I aren't really into the ride so we'll just walk around and people watch but lots to do for the little kids super fun all right now i'm going really far back i have no idea if there's anything back here um there's cows and pigs i have never been to this part of shrine and my mom and i used to come here every single sunday just in reference, um, that's the back of the shrine. So that's the, I want to say newer building, but it's not. It's been there for several years now. And then this is the cemetery. So we're all the way up on the hill on the back side of the shrine where the cemetery is. So more animals over here somewhere. I saw some. There they are. What'd you get? An ice cream sundae? You always seem to find the desserts. <laughs> Okay, so we are back from our day at um, the Shrine of Chestahova. Yeah, you know, we had fun, yeah. right? It's a totally relaxing day. We literally sat and listened to music, walked around, sat and listened to music, walked around. That's what Melody likes to do. She likes to just go sit. Am I keeping you up? <laughs> Her phone keeps falling. So, a couple things about this video. I did it without Albert. Yay me. I've also learned I'm dumb. <laughs> At times. It's shocking to me that, like, I think I'm smart at times. And, like, I'm good at what I do for a living. And then other times I'm just like... So... A lot of this video is going to be messed up and like you're going to have lines like this on both sides because I completely forgot that you have to tilt the camera like this. <laughs> My bad. Sorry about that. So, am I keeping you up? <laughs> you look so bored. You're just talking, talking, talking. <laughs> okay, this keeps falling. Is that like incredibly right for some reason oh my gosh mom all right so anyways so we're just going to show you um what we picked up at the shrine there was a lot of vendors there um so we had a lot of fun but so melody found some stuff so she has this thing for school what do you have that you take every single day to school planet box she loves her planet box and her bag for her planet box just broke like we've had it for like seven years and she's like i need a new bag so we're gonna come home literally before we left she's like i need a new planet box bag right yeah and then there was a 31 consultant there and she had a cash and carry bin and what did we find melody not a planet planet box bag but what did we find to fit her planet box and the consultant was so nice. She went online and found the measurements for what this was. But it fits her planet box perfectly. So Melody has a Tasty Treats Cash and Carry 
new case for her planet box. And while I was there, I got the flat iron case because we're going on our trip soon. So I don't have a case for my flat iron and it was in the cash and carry. So it was 31. Not sure if you guys use those. Um, but her name was Dina, Dina Hennessy, Tennessee. Um, she was super nice. So used her. I'm all about using local people, um, supporting their small businesses. So I was always happy to go to these little vendors and help them out. And okay. Next thing we got, well, first thing that we got when we first went in, I found a Mary Kay lady and I've been using liquid blush as lipstick forever. So I went over to her table and she has some lipstick and she had the Ruby Sparkle lipstick. So of course I had to get it. Her name was Ellen. She was super, super nice. Um, so I got my Mary Kay. Um, what else did we get? We, of course, we are at the shrine for the Polish festival. So you can't leave without a snack. So we got the poppy seed roll. And this one's the poppy seed strudel, which I've never had. We usually just get the poppy seed roll. Do you want to show them what you got? Melody found something. Melody loves pierogies. If you didn't notice in the video I'm already. Have to open their shirt up. It says, I want to see it. Me too. Okay. 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 But you have to hold it up so they can see it. What's it say? Pierogies. Feed me. Feed me pierogies. <laughs> and tell me. And tell me I'm pretty. <laughs> Feed me pierogies and tell me I'm pretty. So she got that. Um, there was another little vendor there. Her name was Ella G Boutique. She had the cutest things. So she had a um, cute little sale section, um, but she had this baby doll block dress. So I got that um, for our trip. And I, I like to, um, we go in October to Florida. So I like to layer leggings, cardigans, tanks. So that's a good layer one. And the last thing we got, um, so I did not know this, but fun fact, I didn't realize like, so all over there was um, amber jewelry vendors um, that was selling amber jewelry. I stopped at this one lady several times because I like jewelry and um, they have, so amber has all the, like, obviously, everybody knows what amber looks like, but it has a lot of the darker pieces in it, too. Um, so, it has the darker pieces as well. But So, I guess there's a city um, in Poland that is considered the city of amber. So, it does tells their whole story right here, which is very interesting. So, I actually really wanted the brown amber ring but they only had brown and black and I didn't like it together so I got all black um but it's sterling silver I thought it was a really neat ring completely unique I love unique things um so that's that's it we just picked up some stuff really try to support local people but we had a lot of fun what was your favorite part of today listening to the music you like sitting and watching listening yeah. to the music watching people dance Polka. Yeah. Polka. All right, that's it. Have a good night. Last, Last time. time.